Today, a California startup company announced a simple, affordable genetic test to reveal a woman's risk for breast or ovarian cancer. So we asked our Dr. John LaPook to tell us more. Testing for the BRCA1 and 2 breast and ovarian cancer gene mutations used to cost up to $4,000. Elad Gill is the co-founder of Color Genomics, the company now offering testing for those two genes plus 17 others for only $249. What we've tried to do is really democratize access uh, to this type of genetic information around breast and ovarian cancer risk, and we wanted to do it in a responsible way. A woman with the BRCA1 mutation has a 55 to 65 percent chance of developing breast cancer by age 70. The test must be ordered by a physician, either the woman's own doctor or one provided by the company. Genetic counseling is included in the price. We don't uh, provide any sort of specific medical advice. Our focus is on enabling women to get this genetic information back. Color Genomics says it has achieved the low price through improved lab and software automation and direct marketing to the public. Spit into the funnel until the amount of saliva reaches the fill two line. The test done on saliva collected at home is not covered by insurance. They don't Known genetic them. mutations account for only 10 to 15 percent of breast and ovarian cancers. Like Oncologist Dr. Jennifer Litton of MD Anderson Cancer Center says this means proper counseling is key. I would be concerned if people misinterpret a negative result as being no risk, especially if they come from a family that has a lot of different cancers or young onsets of cancers. A little more than a decade ago, it cost about $400 million to sequence the entire human genome. That number is now approaching $1,000. But a huge challenge remains, Scott, how best to interpret all that information. Dr. John LaPook, thanks, Doc, very much.